Where does the money from the US $2 trillion stimulus package come from? The US Senate announced a $2 trillion stimulus package to help keep the economy up and running. Where does the government come up with that type of money? Surely they don't have that much cash available. Surely they don't have that much cash available? No, they don't. The US government last year ran at a deficit of about $1 trillion, which means that it spent more than it took in, so it has to print money, not literally, but through complex financial transactions, and or borrow that much money to cover what it spends. That borrowed money comes from the sale of U.S. Treasury bonds, of which about 70% is owned by U.S. institutions like banks, the Federal Reserve, institutional investors, pension funds, etc. And about 30% is owned by similar entities in foreign countries the largest being China and Japan. This stimulus package would increase that deficit, barring any action to either reduce spending elsewhere or to try and increase revenue taxes. To my knowledge, there has been no public discussion by Congress yet as to how either or both would be addressed. One would hope that the stimulus would be seen as an investment in the U.S. economy that would get partially paid back through increased tax revenue and repayment of loans, but that it yet to be seen. The ramifications of deficit spending and accumulation of debt are subject to debate and too numerous for this forum, although I suspect there will be much debate in the comments.